Hey everybody, it's Devin here at Predatory Plants. We uh, just covered Nepenthes glandulifera fairly recently in a couple of videos, but we wanted to check in for another brief one just to show off something cool that we've learned since we um, started breeding with it. This is a female plant and we pollinated the flowers a couple months ago. So they're starting to swell and it turns out those uh, glandular speckles are also present on the flower, the seed pods. <laughs> so if you can see, it's a little funny. Oh, hang on. If you can see, they got little speckles on them, like little uh, little Dalmatians or whatever. Uh, this is just a great plant. I love Nepenthes glandulifera. It's so cool and weird. Um, we're really excited to be breeding with it. You can see it's pretty. Uh, it's a pretty nice uh, spike there. Um, we've got some some good fertilization. It looks like some fun stuff on there. We've got some truncata. Actually, got hamada on there. Um, I don't know which set the, those are, so I don't know if it had good fertilization or not, or if it'll even germinate. Um, we've got Nepenthes mira, so glandulifera by mira sounds awesome. Um, Aristolochioides, so a lot of cool stuff. Uh, should look for that um, in the next, I don't know, year, year and a half um, as they come up. We'll definitely keep you abreast, but just wanted to let everybody know that apparently Nepenthes glandulifera has speckles even on the seed pods. So, uh, <laughs> hope, you, uh, hope you find that as cute as I do. Uh, but that's uh, Nepenthes glandulifera. And uh, feel free to ask any questions in the comments and, and like and subscribe to see more videos like this.